And these are the things which are essentially known as the original Buddhism. And this is a very important point because essentially over the last uh, two and a half thousand years, people have been in, in the dark as to what was the board of the Buddha. They didn't really have the big overview that we have today. Uh, because the world is so integrated today, we have a chance to compare all the suttas, to understand things using modern analytical tools uh, to decide uh, what is the true word of the Buddha. And this is a fairly recent development. Maybe it started happening already maybe a couple of hundred years ago, uh, but it's only fairly recently that we have become very clear as to what the Buddha actually taught. So this is a wonderful thing and it gives us a sense of certainty, maybe not absolute certainty but very high probability that we have the word of the Buddha and we can use that as our guideline, guidelines for deciding what we need to do when we take Buddhism to a new country like Australia. We know the things that are really important we know the things that we can't throw out because they are essential. And we also know, by uh, contrast, those things that are not necessarily essential. And you may perhaps ask, people often ask this question, well, what, what about these other scriptures? Uh, these things which uh, uh, modern scholars say are uh, not the word of the Buddha or probably not the word of the Buddha. Uh, and these are things like, for example, in the Pali scriptures, the Abhidhamma, things like the commentaries, the Visuddhimagga. And so how should we relate to these scriptures? Some people find a lot of inspiration in there. They find that these things are important. Can we just throw them out? And the way we should relate to these other scriptures, in my opinion, is we don't need to say that these things are wrong. We don't even need to compare them to the suttas. What we rather should do is say, well, because it wasn't spoken by the Buddha, because we know that with a fair degree of certainty, there is uncertainty regarding these scriptures. We don't really know whether they're right or wrong. 